guys. My kid says I'm not allowed to call you my peeps, so I can't do that. Anyway, I got a new video up. It's been a long time with the COVID and all that stuff. But uh, Shannon wants, I know it's Shannon, but she lets me call her Shannon, and that's cool with me. Um, anyway, we got a new video up from her, and I hope you enjoyed this first video for a long time. Uh, so let's get started. Enjoy. Okay, hi, Shannon. I know people are going to say Shannon, but she and I have been talking to Shannon and Chris. Um, I'm just wondering if you're there. I know you said you want to be there, so I'm going to turn the Vox box on to ask you how you feel after the um, after all that happened, the trial with Chris and everything that happened and your family and how you're doing now and have you crossed over and have you seen your kids? So I'm about to put the box on, and you tell me what's going on with you, okay? So are you there? Hello. Can you talk over the other things going on? Okay, I heard you too. Hi. Take your time and get used to things, and we could um, we could make them uh, get a little better for you. I heard you say once the trial is over. So tell me what you thought about his trial. I want to remind people that you should listen to this with headphones. How do you feel about the fact that he got a death sentence but then, because of your own family, they commuted it to life. Shannon, how are you feeling where you are? Do you feel that he finally got what he deserved? What do you think about this movie made about your family and what happened? So how do you think they portrayed you in the movie? How do you think they portrayed Scott in the movie? Did it bring any memories back? Well, first off, you saw the movie, didn't you? How did you see the movie?
How do you feel they they projected the whole event, you know, the whole sequence of the movie? Is it realistic? Was that how it happened? How do you feel that people are watching this and it's popular? I mean, it's a Netflix special. Did you ever think you'd be famous for the way you died? Well, I think maybe this is all I should ask about this topic for now. We could go it into depth at another time, okay? Okay. Do you feel like you've gotten, like, to the point where you can cross over and feel better about it? Have you finally crossed over to be with your children? I wanted to ask you about the little boy. Some people have asked me about this. Your, your little son who's unborn when he died, do you see him as a child now that you're there? Is he on the other side of a child or an infant? Is he playing with your little girls too? Or does he stay as a baby soul and maybe come back into the earth as a baby with another chance to live? Are you feeling better? Do you feel less angry? Can you tell us how it feels to be where you are? I think I'd like this video to be not too much longer because I want people to hear that you're all right. Have you come to, Have you come to terms with things even though you may have been angry?
have you anything to say to the viewers? You know that I'm putting this on YouTube. I mean, like, you were, like, really into this stuff. You know, like, right now, you've got a lot of viewers all over YouTube. Okay. Well, I'm going to give you a few more seconds, maybe five seconds, to say goodbye to everybody until maybe we do another video, okay? So there you go. I hope you guys like this video. If you have any suggestions for future videos, let me know. I've opened my comments again. Try to be nice. I don't want to deal with anything that has to do with COVID. Okay, let me know in the comments. Don't forget, subscribe, ring the bell. My hands aren't in the picture. Sub subscribe, ring the bell. <laughs>